So, Sunday morning workout. It's not, as usual, it's not the one on modifying, because I have fun programming this little Saturday things. So we start with the warm up, which is a five minutes arm wrap, okay? Arm wrap for warm up doesn't really apply exactly as we do it for the, um, for the mech coins, because obviously we are just keeping it going for five minutes. So we work, we focus on movements and technique, but we don't do as many rounds and reps as possible, okay? And warm up piece, build up through the five minutes. You're going through three exercises, so it's five, half burpees, okay, so not push a burpee, down, all the way up with your legs, coming up and stand, or you can do up and then jump at the end, but no push up. Because we don't do a push up, it doesn't mean that we do this, so one going a full plank position, solid abs, we don't bounce down to me. And jump. Then, 10 side squat jumps. So, if you can do it in your room or in your space, down one way, jump one way, okay? So we use one leg more than the other each rep. If you don't have space or you don't feel safe, just the normal squat jumps. And then 15, foot to hand. One, the pause, two, the pause, and so on. Okay? So, five, 10, 15. The foot to hands are actually uneven. If you're a bit of a OCD kind of person, you can do 16. It's not a great problem. Okay? So, five minutes. Oh. Five minutes. Everybody ready? Starting in 10 seconds. With five hard burpees. Three, two, one. Let's go. Good. Make sure you keep your core solid, okay? Don't let your hips collapse when you do it. Don't need a push up if you don't want to do it. Then go into the 10 squat jumps with a little side jump. Really good. And then on the floor for some foot to hand. So 15 of those. Don't need to stay too long. But let's take that split second to ensure that we're actually having a little stretch. Mm -hmm. Good. Once you're done, straight into your next round. We still have just about half of the time. So two, two minutes, 40, 50. Thank you. 
Nice. There's nothing too complicated. If you feel your pace is a bit slow, you can go a bit faster. You can increase it as you go. If you feel you're out of breath already, that's fine. Don't need to overforce it in the warm up. Let your heart settle to an efficient heart rate slowly on its own. And don't go too fast, Paul. Got 90 seconds of warm up to go. Good. Try to make those jumps fluid, so from one side to another. Still 15 seconds. You've done as the foot to hand, then burpees, then side squat jumps. Rest. Awesome. So, we're not going to need, well, I mean, it's, it's obviously up to you, but I don't think we're going to need pen and paper. However, however, again, it's up to you. So, first of all, in terms of um, things, Okay, kit. We're going to need something for a hand snatch, okay, dumbbell or barbell, so a fluid dumbbell, hang, snatch, okay, swap hang, snatch. If you do it with a barbell, it's going to be hang. Snatch. Then we're going to do overhead squats. You can use the same bar, you can use the same dumbbell, something lighter, something heavier. And we're then going to do the goblet lunges. And that should definitely be a little heavier than your overhead squats and stuff, okay? Usually, okay? So, Stay with me, okay, it looks complicated, but it's not. It's gonna be five Metcons today, okay? Each of the Metcons have a time cap. It can, it's starting from really short, and it goes <laughs> expansion, okay? So Metcon number one, you have a one minute time cap to do 10 burpees. Okay, it's a little sprint, just mash it. Okay. Make them, then we rest. Okay, there's not a specific amount of rest. Hope you don't have anything to do after this. Then the second make one is a two minutes time cap. And you do 10 burpees and 25 push ups. Then the third make one. It's got a five minutes time cut. And you're doing 10 burpees, 25 push up, and 40 hand snatch. I think we know where this is going. 
The fourth Mekon is a nine minutes time cap. Ten burpees, twenty-five push-ups, forty hang snatch, and fifty overhead squats. The last Mekon has got a thirteen minutes time cap. Ten burpees, twenty-five push-ups. 40 hang snatch, 50 overhead squats, and 100 goblet lunges. All right, Sarah there, all good? You've got time cap anyway. Okay, so that's the point of it. So we're not gonna work, that's in total, that's 30 minutes of workout, okay? Wow, well, that's horrific. No, no, no. That's horrific. <laughs> So, the last two are quite long, okay, and high volume, but the rest of them is fine. And we're going to rest, honestly. We are. If we've got time at the end, we're going to do a little bit of a core workout, uh, sort of like accessory core. But let's focus on the first one first. So, what I'm going to ask you right now, I'll give you maybe a minute or two to make sure that you've got everything that you need for snatch, or squat, and goblet lunges. Okay. So try to think, it's, I understand if it's hard to predict what weight you're gonna use, but try to make sure that at least you've got something feasible for the start, okay? Something you think is okay for you. Okay, so hand snatch, or squat, and goblet lunges. Doesn't have to be the same weight for the three things. Absolutely not. Um, depends on your abilities, on your, uh, where you feel more confident, etc., etc. Good. As so long as reps will be done respecting standards, respecting quality, okay. And remember that is a kind of a workout where we want to sort of keep it going, okay, so say you choose a weight for overhead squats, shouldn't be anywhere near your 100 max if we know what we need, okay? So it's gonna be 50 of them. So, I'm gonna set the time cut for wad number one, which is 10 burpees. Do not underestimate this, you, it's almost you getting into the high intensity. Okay, so just 10 burpees, speed of light, okay? Ready? Ten seconds. Mm -hmm. Three, two, one, go! Ten burpees. With a little jump. Nice, get them done. Just straight into your next strip. Good job, come on. Come on, Sarah, come on, Scott. Any seconds to go, come on, come on. Woo! Yes! Right! We established that all of you can do 10 burpees within a minute. Okay? That's it. That's math. It's facts. Now, it's a two minute workout. Well, time cut. Time cut. So you have 25 push ups. Okay? 10 burpees, 25 push ups. You want to aim to finish it within two minutes. So you choose which kind of push-ups you're going to do. Toes or knees, okay? As long as your chest goes all the way down to the ground and you extend your arms, you fully extend your arms. 
you're gonna de- all of you is gonna have definitely longer than a minute to do 25 push-ups. That means that if you pick the right choice, you're gonna do it. Okay. Knees. Back on number two. Ten bar piece, 25 push-ups. Ten seconds. Four, three, two, one. Same speed. Come on, let's go. Come on, guys. Be resilient. Make sure that you stay with the same speed as before. Soon as you've got the chance, when it will, you will finish your burpees, get into push-ups, come on. Still over a minute to go, come on. Don't give up, that's still 45 seconds of push-ups to do. Good. Make those arms work, come on. Let's get some pecs pumped. That's it, Scott, that's it. Come on, come on, Colleen. Go. One stop, couple more. Three, two, one, rest. Okay. Well done. Well done. That was definitely hard there. Now we've got the next one. Don't worry, I promise you rest. We're gonna rest. On the rest for a minute or two. So you now add the 40 hand snatch. First of all, remember whether you're using a dumbbell or a, or a barbell, okay? The hand snatch starts from here, okay? You're not allowed to go lower than your knees, okay? You can start anywhere along your thigh, okay? You go a little higher, you go a little lower, but definitely not lower than your knees. And remember to lift the weight up, whatever that is, okay, to full extension before resetting it to the half position, okay? 40 of them, that's really hard to predict now because we are all gonna have different weights, okay? I understand that, it's hard to get a perfect uh, prediction when if you're home, you've got different things, but, what I'm saying is, work hard and try to make it in the, in the time cup, okay? This is the aim of it. Breathe, five minutes, time cup. 10 burpees, 25 push-ups, 40 hands up. 10 seconds. Three, two, one, go. Good. 
Get rid of those burpees that we know that we can do very quickly. And we then go into push ups. Very good, guys. Punch up, straight arms, Jackie, come on. Straight up, that's it. That's good. We are pretty much halfway and we're all at the snatch. We're gonna smash this. Come on, come on. It's 40, it looks like a big number, but it's not that bad. It's four sets of 10. It's okay if you wanna do cleans, Davey, if your shoulder is, is sore. Don't worry about it. Show me those elbows coming forward. That's it. Come on, Sarah, don't you do that. Don't do the, that head movement there. You're doing it right, come on. Still over a minute to go. You've got this, guys, come on. In a minute, you can do probably 20 reps if you want to. Few more reps if you need to finish it. 10 seconds, come on. Look at you. Everybody done in the time cup. Okay, rest, breathe. Next one is gonna be the same, but you add 50 over at squat, okay? So, seems impossible, seems like, oh my God, I'm done, now I cannot breathe, my life ends here. But you will change pace, okay? But from the next one, it's gonna be a totally different workout. So I try to do this little kind of game here. 
to show you how you should dip, paste differently once, okay? So now it's gonna be a nine minute workout. That's basically a chipper. You don't start with 10 super fast burpees, okay? You might need to go on your knees for push-ups even if you're super strong. Okay, it's not saying you have to, but you, you might start thinking about it. And you need to think about a strategy to break up your ribs. Okay, so not too many at a time. And make sure that you take your time. Uh, don't go too heavy and overhead squats if you're not confident with it. And I'm not saying that you have to go light. I'm just saying, you know, be sensible. This is it. Okay, so I'll give you another minute. And we aim to finish it. Obviously, don't worry about uh, like looking at other people or the person next to you. We're all using different things for different exercises, so don't really. It's uncomparable. Not that you usually have to compare, but now it's even impossible to do it. So, so big breath. 10 burpees, 25 push-ups, 40 hand snatch, and 50 overhead squats. Get ready, guys. 10 seconds. Three, two, one, go. Break down your reps when you get to push-ups sensibly, okay? After push-ups, you will have to do 90 reps this time, okay? So be sensible. Try to, so you break it down, but try not to let yourself rest for too long, okay? That's why you don't go to failure when you do reps. Elbows, Davy. Good. That's it. Okay, we still have six minutes, so we haven't even reached the third minute. Lovely. Come on. Nice and steady. Don't do a million reps at a time.
Very good, Sarah. Come on. Yes. Really good reps. Keep working hard, guys, come on. Make sure you pay attention to details, okay? So when you're doing your overhead squat, your wrists are in line, okay? We're not just going all the way back. Bar is above your head, not behind. Okay, let's make sure of that. Nice view, Davy. That's nice. Really good. That's perfect. We have three minutes to complete 50 overhead squats after your snatch. That's great. That's wonderful, guys. Come on. Keep working till the end. You dropping the towel, Scott? <laughs> Still thirty seconds of work. Work as hard as you can for the last 20 seconds. Come on, Davey. That's it, Sarah, come on. Good job, Paul. 10 seconds, just keep it going, guys. Mm. 
rest. Okay. The final proof now. Wow. Yes. Are there any are there any other options apart from the overhead squat? Because my hand is so warm outside, my hands keep slipping on the bar. Yeah, so you can do front squats like Sarah's done. That's a good option. Oh front squats. Okay, that's fine. It's just my hands are slipping all over the place. Perfectly acceptable. Do you know how yeah, to cool. Do you know what? Do you not do you not have chalk at home? I've got baby powder, but it's away in the house somewhere. <laughs> uh, I don't know. It's not quite the same. <laughs> no. I'll get some chalk. No, it's okay. Well, just asking. Okay, so I'll leave you a couple of minutes to rest. Your last chipper is coming. I'm pretty sure that even though not everybody finished, we were all pretty close. We were definitely well into our overhead squats, into our squats, okay, some variations. So well done, everyone. Now, after your squats, after your squats, is 100 goblet lunges, okay? So, let's face it, it's probably gonna be a 30 minutes AMRA, okay? So you just keep going for 30 minutes, see how far you can get, okay? A good achievement would be a good number of goblet squats, or goblet lunges, sorry. Okay, so after your squats, try to get rid of the squats as far as, as possible, and then you do as many lunges as you can, okay? Of course, if you reach 100, you can stop before the 13 minutes. Not gonna say no. Well, is it front rack or the goblet uh, lunges? So, yeah. that's a good question. It depends on what you've got. Okay, depends on what you wanna have. Like, if you do it with a bar, it's way harder. Like, way harder. If you've got a kettlebell, you can either choose to go one side or the, the actual goblet position. Um, if you go one side, just make sure that, you know, even out, yeah, 10 and 10 or whatever you wanna split them into. 30 more seconds. Just the time for me to set the clock for 13 minutes. To wish you good luck and do your best, guys. Okay, remember, don't start too fast. There's no meaning for it. Okay, it doesn't mean go as slow as possible. Okay, just because it seems like. Okay, 10 seconds. Three, two, one, and start. Ten burpees. Feels like ages ago last time we did burpees.
Very good. Just keep chipping away without too much speed, just consistency. Make sure your breathing is regular, brings oxygen to those mighty muscles of yours. Got still 10 minutes to go. Try not to stop for too long, guys. Otherwise, as you lose the pace, small brief pauses, you can catch your breath, and again. Come on guys, got plenty of time to work. This is your last task of today. It's seven, just short of eight minutes to go.
That's it. We're doing amazing, guys. Come on. Keep chipping away those reps. Come on. Let's go back to work. I know it's hard, but it's not even five minutes left for workout. Sorry, Val, was it goblet lunges or squats? Uh, goblet lunges. Lunges, okay. Gun shot. Upstairs. <laughs> no, it's not true. It's not gunshot. Come on guys, get past those squats. Come on Jackie, let's go, come on Sarah. Let's do stuff Paul. Gather all your energies. That's three minutes. Good. As long as you keep working hard, you're doing the right thing. Two minutes. Awesome. Good guys, we're all at the lunges, come on. That is one and a half minute.
doing great, guys. Really are. Now we're at 45 seconds to the end. I don't really see the point in stopping now. Come on. Ten seconds, come on. Tip one and stop. There you go. You survived. Maybe. We'll see in a couple hours. Well done. That was a great workout. That was nasty.